So let's start with the next program. Write a program to input the cost price and the selling price of an article. If the selling price is more than the cost price, then the calculate and display the actual profit and profit percent. Otherwise, calculate and display actual loss and loss percent. If the cost price and the selling price are equal, the program displays the message neither profit nor loss. Now in this program, you have to take the input from the user, the cost price and the selling price of the article and whether and then after going, you are going to check whether the cost price is uh, uh, bigger than the selling price, then the loss and if the selling price is much uh, bigger than the cost price, then it is profit. Okay. So let's start. Now you can see I have already taken the input from the user by using the scanner class and the respective input like cost price, article cost price is stored in the variable CP and article selling price is stored in the variable SP. Okay. Now I am going to find out the if the loss has been taken or I or profit or neither loss neither uh, profit. So let's uh, check. So I am going to compare it first to, you know, with the use of the with the help of the if statement. So if CP is greater than SP, it means the cost price is greater than the selling price means loss has been taken. So so loss equals to CP minus SP. So this is the loss and loss percent equals to uh, loss by CP into 100. So this is the loss percentage and then after I am going to print the loss and loss percentage respectively. Next in the LC block I am going to compare whether say a selling price is greater than the cost price and if the, this happen then the profit uh, will be take place so SP is greater than CP okay. So this time I am going to uh, compute or calculate the profit and profit percentage so profit equals to SP minus CP and the profit percentage equals to uh, profit by CP into 100. So this is the profit percentage and now I am going to print them accordingly. In the else block it means that neither CP is greater than SP and not CP is less than SP. It means that in the A when the control goes to the else block it means that the article price and selling price both are same so neither loss or no, nor profit actually takes place. So in the else block I am going to print. So in this else block you can see I have already again written here neither loss nor profit it means when the else block actually go execute it means the profit uh, is not taken place and loss has been taken, not taken place so cost price and selling both are same and if this lc block is take uh, is uh, execute it means the profit actually made and if the first if block it means cp is greater than sp takes place then the loss must be happened so let's run the program so it asking me to enter the article cost price suppose article cost price is 1200 okay article selling price is suppose 1500 okay so you can see profit is 300 and profit percentage is 25 percent okay let's run the program again and uh, enter the article cost price suppose 1200 again and article selling price is 1000 okay so uh, cost price is um, lesser than the uh, sorry uh, selling price is lesser than the cost price it means cost price is greater than the selling price so first if block is going to execute so let's yes the loss is 200 and the pro loss percentage is rupees 16.66664 like uh, this fractional value okay ne next run the program again suppose i am just entering the same artic article cost price that is 1200 and selling uh, uh, article price is 1200 so 
cost price and selling price both are same so neither loss neither profit actually happen so let's see what's actually message actually so neither loss nor profit okay so this time the last else block actually execute so in this way you can easily cal uh, calculate the um, by taking the cost price and selling price of an article and um, you can easily calculate the um, profit or loss or profit percentage or loss percentage respectively okay